Hi, my name is Safiri Moses Yamiamba, aka Young Fury. I'm originally from Congo, but most well, some of my childhood was in Tanzania. Me and my mom left, and my little brother left Congo, moved to Tanzania. I was only four years old at the time. My father, two older brothers, one older sister were left in Congo, but shortly joined us in Tanzania. We lived in Tanzania, Kigoma, for about three to five years, I can't really remember, for I was just a child. My grandfather was Jamaican as far as I know, but his father was originally from Congo, Zahire. My grandfather, who, li who goes by the name Joseph Yambayamba, left Zahire in a search for a better life. He decided to go to Jamaica because most of his friends were moving to Jamaica. Joseph Yambayamba didn't live in Jamaica all his life. He went back to Congo shortly after he heard that he was, the war was over. That was when he made the mistake by moving back to his homeland. My grandfather had a wife and approximately three to four, maybe six children. I don't really know because my father don't really like telling me about his family members. I really don't know why. My grandmother died about three years before I was born. I never got to see her. My grandfather passed away as well before I was born. I don't really know what happened to him, but I think he died during the war between President Mobutu and the white French. I still pray for him. Anyways, my father and my mother had approximately 13 children in all the lifetime. The first two had, the first two had passed away, the last one that my mother had passed away as well, and my, uh, my mother also lost a son. Her child passed away as well. I still pray for them, still now. Rest in peace. We moved to Australia when I was seven years old and I have been here with my family except my older sister. She's a roughly six, 26 now. She has six children and married. She had her first child when she was 15, turning 16 years old. Life in Australia is alright. I'm used to it now. I've lived in Perth over, ever since we moved here. The furthest that I've been from Perth is public attorney and any further than that I haven't been. I, stu I studied at Meabuka Primary School for all my schooling, my primary schooling. I'm now studying at Balga Senior High School in 11. My dream and hopes are probably to become a famous singer, rapper, or if not, just, a, just to become a youth worker. I still got a lot to learn in life. My mother always told me, never give up on my dreams and hopes, no matter what it takes. While my father told me, spread your wings and fly, son, just like the ego, be, be free, be yourself, you can touch the sky. Those were the, some of the last words that my father said to me after they divorced with my mom. I miss my father, even though I really didn't spend time with him, and, but he's gone back to Tanzania. I don't think I will ever see him again. My trip to Australia was one of the most calm and friendliest trip. It's as if Moses from the Bible was, was guiding us to the promised land. Well, my family is happy where we are, so, now, so maybe Australia is the promised land for my family and still is.